Hello friends, today's video is regarding setting up email notifications for contingent workers. First, we'll see what are, who is a contingent worker. A contingent worker is a worker who is hired on a temporary or fixed term contract basis to provide specific services for a specific project or period of time. Contingent workers are not employees and therefore do not receive the same rights and benefits as permanent employees. So the next slide is regarding setting up notifications to be sent to contingent workers for different events during the hiring or rehiring process. So what are the scenarios? So what are the scenarios involved with the contingent workers? Let's see. You can configure to send notifications in the following scenarios. When a contingent worker is hired using add contingent worker or imports or APIs. When a contingent worker is rehired as a contingent worker. When a regular employee is rehired as a contingent worker. So these are the three scenarios wherein the notification should, should be sent to the manager or the vendor when a contingent worker is hired or rehired. What is the procedure for this? So these are the steps involved for uh, sending email notification. So we have to go to the admin center and click on email notification template settings. Under this, there are two templates welcome message for contingent workers that is a notification email will be sent to the contingent workers after they are hired the second is contingent workers recruit notification so when a contingent worker is hired email will be sent to the to the managers or supervisors or the vendors so what we have to do is click on any template to see the standard configuration and make modifications. So you can modify the template as per your need, as per the client's requirement. After ticking on the checkbox, you can save the changes. So after this, the next step will be, we'll go to manage data and create a new contagion workers email notification configuration. So we'll configure the email notification for the contagion worker. So, so the scenario which we'll be seeing today is manager should receive higher notification mail while hiring the contagion worker. So we'll go to the system. So the first step was email notifications. So I'm typing in the search bar, email notification template settings. So we'll be setting the templates first. So here you can see there are many templates in the email notification template section. There may be more than 100. So we want the template for contingent worker. So we'll go directly to contingent worker. So here you can see contingent workers, higher notification and welcome message for contingent workers. So these are the two templates available for contingent workers. So these we have to take them. So these are already ticked here. And then after taking it, we save this save notification settings so we'll check the templates here i will click on contingent workers higher notification this is the template for the higher notification this is the email subject and this is the email body whatever content you want to add in the mail if 
you want to upload a file you can click on this choose file and upload the file which you want to attach with this mail this is download that is we can download this template and keep it as a backup and there is upload template file so we can upload the template as well so usually we use, we use download to keep a backup of the standard template here so i will be keeping a ba backup now so click on download save it so when you open this download template so this is the template here you can see there is the subject and also the body of the te higher template these brackets first name last name and user id these are called tokens we cannot change these tokens so when uh, email is sent to the manager for the contingent worker who is hired the name of the employee will be reflected here with the user id of that contingent worker so i'll be changing the subject line here so i'm using the higher notification so this email will be sent to the manager new joinee contingent worker hire i am updating the body of the email hello contingent worker the name of the worker will be reflected in this tokens first name and the last name with the user id contingent worker with the user id is hired in company company name guys and we'll save this okay. so you can see the subject and the body which i have changed for the email notification so after this the next step is manage data in manage data we'll go to contingent workers mail notification So you, here you can see there is no notification. We have to create it. So we'll go to create new contingent workers email notification. So here we'll assign whether this higher notification will go to the manager, supervisor, or the vendor, or any other person. So use case. What are the drop downs? Notification on contingent worker. Welcome mail on contingent worker. So I'm not sending a welcome mail. So I I want to send a mail for the hire. So click on notification on contingent worker. Template. Again notification mail template. Not a welcome mail. Recipients. So who will receive this email notification? 
a scenario a scenario is manager should receive higher notification mail while hiring the contingent worker so who are the recipients work order owner supervisor that is the manager work order owner and supervisor both or the contingent worker so in in this case we cannot select contingent worker welcome mail will go to the contingent worker and the hire mail will go to these people work order owner supervisor or these two both so here i will select supervisor and save this so this is the configuration for the email notification for hire so now we will test this scenario i'll duplicate my slide so to hire an a contingent worker we go to add contingent worker so this is the employee file for the contingent worker so we will fill all the information here so this is the hire date i'm selecting this company and the event reason start contingent worker first name okay the last name or it username click on continue okay so the mandatory fields are already reflecting here so i'll go to next page continue next is contingent worker assignment information so i am only filling the mandatory fields here position select the position so you can see the company business unit division location department and time zone has been reflected so the supervisor so this email has to be sent to the manager so i will assign the manager here mark p okay so this is the manager for this employee it is a contingent worker who will receive the email be sure that his email id has been updated in the contact information so that he can receive the mail I'll click on continue. Work order information. So the start date of the work order and the end date of the work order has been updated. And the vendor name. So we are done with the. employee file for this contingent worker click on submit so this employee has been created has been hired in the system so our scenario was that the manager will receive the hire notification so i had put my email id in the manager's email id business email id so let me check whether i have received an email so here you can see mail from the system so this is the notification received to the manager hello contingent worker ankit parik that is the first name and the last name of the employee with the user id is hired in this company regards so this is how 
we configure the email notification higher notification for the contingent worker we can make changes to the template as well so this was a higher notification template we can also check for welcome mail as well so this is the end of the video thank you